Hi everyone, Assalamualaikum. Today I will be reviewing my favorite TV shows and I hope you guys will enjoy. But first, let me introduce myself. My name is Muhammad Zuhairizan bin Suhaimi and my student number is 2021-670-624. So, I'm going to give my review on TV shows entitled The Big Bang Theory. The genre of this TV shows is a sitcom comedy written by Chuck Lorre and other 23 writers directed by Mark Sandrowski. These TV shows have 12 seasons with a total of 279 episodes. The first episode was released on September 24, 2007 and the last episode was released on May 16, 2019. The rating for this The Big Bang Theory is 18 years old and above because some material may not be suitable for children under the age of 18. The Big Bang Theory received mixed reviews and critics from the first season, but it was more favorable in the next season. Until the season 12, The Big Bang Theory have received 27 awards and 51 nominations since they have been released. The main character in the Big Bang Theory are Kelly as Penny, Jim as Sheldon, Johnny as Leonard, and Mayim as Amy. It has a side character which are Simon acting as Howard, Melissa as Bernadette, Kunal as Raj, and Kevin as Stewart. As a summary, the Big Bang Theory tells a story about lives of four socially awkward friends. Leonard, Sheldon, Howard, and Raj take a wild turn when they meet the beautiful and free-spirited Penny. In this review, I have highlighted 5 memorable scenes that I love to watch. The first scene is about when Penny first moved into the apartment. Leonard and Sheldon, while returning to their apartment, notice a new tenant moving into the apartment opposite of theirs, a young, wannabe actress, Penny. New neighbor? Evidently. Significant improvement over the old neighbor. 200-pound transvestite with a skin condition? Yes, she is. Oh, hi. 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 The second scene I love the most is when Penny and Sheldon got emotional while looking into each other's eyes. As they realized they meant more to each other than they could comprehend. And they realized that they weren't in love, but they did love each other. The third scene when Sheldon first meet Amy. Sheldon and Amy become one of the most beloved couples on the show over time. But they meet thanks to a joke by Rush and Howard who put Sheldon's info into a dating site. The first time they meet is absolutely hilarious as they connect perfectly in the awkwardness. It's an ongoing joke in the series that Leonard and Penny break up a lot and that Leonard proposes a lot. Leonard assumed that Penny was basing her feelings for him on her sadness but the conversation ended in an engagement. This is when Leonard proposed for real and this is the fourth scene that I think it's sweet to rewatch. The last memorable scene I've highlighted is Sheldon Nobel Prize speech. The scene is in the final episode, unsurprisingly, is one of the most satisfying moments to rewatch. Sheldon and Amy are receiving the Nobel Prize which is a phenomenal end to the series to start with. And everyone is getting happy ending, but it's the speech makes it so incredible. There is a lot of moral value and life lesson that we can learn from this TV show. One of it is to choose the right woman. Sheldon and Leonard are proof that when it comes to sharing a room, it is essential you make the right choice to avoid frustratingly frequent disagreement However, if you do find yourself in a pickle of your roommate, take Sheldon lead and write up a roommate agreement. Also, we should accept that life isn't always how we plan it. Life has no set path and its, and its twists and turns will take everyone by surprise. No matter how hard someone tries, they will never be able to anticipate everything that will come and that's okay. It doesn't mean things will turn out for the worse, but it does mean that some might not come to pass as expected. Another life lesson from this TV show is to always believe in your dreams. Sheldon remained convinced he would eventually win his Nobel Prize. Most people doubt him because even though he was a genius, 
the chances of him making a groundbreaking discovery were few. And lastly, it's okay not to win at everything. Every character in this story comes with its set of shortcomings and are seen as flaws. However, all the character in this story tells us that you are not obligated to live up to everyone's expectation. I strongly recommend you guys to watch this TV show as I feel like it's the best sitcom comedy I ever watched. It was made suitable for family and storyline combines with the knowledge and laughter which makes it so fun to watch. So that's all from me. Thank you for listening guys. Assalamualaikum.